My name is Jeff Rockwell, and I am the founder and president of Music International. I started Music International in 2009 after traveling extensively to, to many, many countries and discovering so many musicians that just did not have the equipment and training that they needed so desperately. Music International is an organization that exists in order to make the lives of musicians easier. We are operating in, in less developed countries, poorer countries that just don't have that immediate access we always seem to have to instruments, to accessories, guitar strings, picks, cables. Here in the U.S. we can find those items pretty easily within a few miles of our homes a lot of the time, or we can find them online pretty easily. But uh, in a place like Burundi, you don't have just such so much ready access. So, so we exist for what you might call an underserved musician. One, one thing that, that we also provide through Music International is we teach people online. Uh, I have a regular student each week in Burundi that I teach over Zoom, um, teach him guitar, just show him how to you know, play the basics of guitar. We also have a vocal teacher that works with us and she teaches people online as well. So there's, there's also online training that we provide. Our representative in Burundi, his name is Deo, he has, it always fluctuates a little bit, but he has about 20 to 25 guitar students at any given time that he teaches. And we've been supplying him with guitars for about a year and a half now. I have a, a core group of supporters that are just right there, you know, and um, they've been really, really good, tremendous supporters. The one big challenge was helping people in this context in the U.S. understand that there's even such a need. Because when you go to, say, a concert or to a church service or where we see musicians playing, it's easy to just assume, oh, they've got stuff, they've got the stuff they need. They've got the guitars, they've got the amps, they've got the cables, they've got strings, they've got whatever, oh, they've got the stuff they need. So it's easy to just assume that there's no lack. It's easy to believe that the musicians you see performing have just, just have what they need already. I know for a fact that without Music International, there are musicians in Burundi, India, and Albania right now that would not be playing what they're playing. They wouldn't have the guitars they need. They wouldn't have the extra equipment they need, the cables and the strings. They wouldn't have the drum sets they need. Uh, we've actually supplied entire drum sets for musicians in India, for, for example. Uh, if it weren't for Music International, there would be none of that. There, there would be no uh, guitar music strumming away in Burundi, Africa with the people that we're connected to. It, you know, the thing that keeps me motivated is each individual time I'm able to send funds to somebody that I know is a passionate musician and I know I'm making a difference. Um, and and so, sometimes it's just a really small amount. Like uh, say like a week or so ago, I sent just a hundred dollars to, to somebody in Albania that, that needed some new equipment. Just that little bit, that $100 was something he would never be able to come up with. You know, that right there keeps me stirred, keeps me motiv motivated, yeah. <laughs> really is true when you operate a nonprofit corporation you're not you're, you're not selling an item for somebody to purchase from you you're selling a dream you're selling a vision you're selling a hope 